hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video we'll be making ogbono soup and this particular soup is my favorite soup yeah without wasting so much time let's go into the cooking proper so for this food we'll be needing some stock fish smoked fish dried fish beef cow skin ogbono with oil mixture some bonnet pepper some blended crayfish and of course our vegetable pumpkin leaves precisely also guys would be needing some salt seasoning cubes and onions so guys into the boiling water i added my beef and my chopped cow skin that's all we'll be adding for now we don't want to add the other Fish, the dried fish, the smoked fish and the stock fish so it doesn't get soft and we don't see it in the soup. So I added some onions, bonnet pepper, blended crayfish, some salt, some seasoning for the beef and of course my seasoning cubes. And this is all we need for this particular beef to get soft. Added some water and covered to cook for about 15 minutes guys and just about 15 minutes the beef was soft and I added my stocked fish dried fish into this pot now we've we'll been letting this cook for just about one minute we don't want to leave this cooking for a long time since the beef is already soft I added a little amount of water and the remaining blended crayfish guys so guys we just we don't want this to cook for a very long time the beef is already soft and we'll just have this cook for about a minute so i'll cover and in just about a minute the fish has already blended with the beef and the next thing we want to add is the ogbono and palm oil mixture into the pot and guys at this point our soup is almost ready guys almost ready normally when the yobono and palm oil mixture is added to our stock we don't want to leave this cooking for a very long time so yeah at this point guys our bono is almost ready so guys we'll just give it a good stir and you know allow to you know cook for a few seconds guys less than one minute about 15 minutes or thereabout make sure to give this a good stir guys on a medium heat like i said we don't want to leave this to cook for a very long time 50 seconds is okay on a medium heat just about 50 seconds after we left the obono to cook, I'll be adding my vegetable pumpkin leaves precisely and yeah, we don't want to leave this also to cook for a long time. We'll give this a good stir and just turn off the heat immediately. So guys, this is basically everything for obono soup. Super duper easy and fast. Let me know how you make your own obono soup. Please guys don't forget to like, subscribe and click on the notification bell so you get my videos first and see you in the next video. Mwah.